Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I am Starco Gaming and we are back with another Dragon Champion video. Guys, if you are level 15 or below, make sure to use the promo code Starco to get a free starter pack to do so. It is pretty simple. You go in the settings, use promo code and you enter the code Starco, S-T-A-R-K-O, you press OK and you will receive a free starter pack and hopefully you guys will enjoy the goodies. Guys, today we are back with another battleground video guys on this uh, well day after black friday guys apparently uh we're gonna be jumping in there and we're gonna try to get a third win of the season guys so far my opening did not attack me at all i think he he just knows that he has no chance to beat me so he's just staying quiet that's my opinion because if we look at his roster guys 183,000 power which is actually pretty solid uh 205,000 max team power but if we look at his heroes other than the spend the team, the spend the team is actually very solid. Also, uh, the uncle is not fast enough for me, uh, but the rest is is okay. But other than that, the rest of his roster is just very easy to counter gas. There's not a lot of metas there. There's the the pandem metas, and after that, it's just a bunch of randoms. I mean decent goblin team and that's pretty much it so that's gonna be a very easy battleground there's the orc team but a pretty weak orc team to be honest so guys that shall be a very easy one we have to pin the team here then we got the human team here and then if we go up here we have the orc team which is going to be easy to counter with my um wow how we call them i want my goblin team and the goblin team that shall be very easy to counter with my uh probably my pride team so yeah uh it seems very easy battleground so far guys but first we gotta beat his uh, his main team that's gonna be the main option here so first we're gonna go and we're gonna bring some a decent character here so we're gonna have to go full on with the um with the panda team to be honest guys um so well half panda team i guess which that, we'll get that, that, that. So that's kind of the main team here, guys. And uh, I mean, Shaolin is going to make in the team, guys, because we're going to need that turn meter up because his uncle is at, it's pretty fast. So with that, guys, this is my main arena team. Uh, we're just going to, we're going to destroy that and we're going to get a, we should in theory get a 52 points here, guys. At least that's her team for 52 points. Let's see how this is going to go. Uh, we're going to use that on a uh, little fella in the back. Here we go. So we can drop that. And this is game over. Pretty much. Charge up. Another charge up and smash things. Hey, it's not full kill. Oh, might actually take a little bit of damage here. I don't know. I guess we're going to see. Might be fine. Yeah, we're going to be fine. Here we go. Can we... Uh, come on, we want to kill him. There we go. We killed him before he had a chance to attack us. So, that is a 52 points around, guys. That's that's the way to start this shit up. Sadly, we have to use... We cannot really split the panda team anymore, which is definitely uh, a bummer. But we do have other pandas we can use later on. So, we have this team here. No idea what I'm going to use against this one yet. But... Before we go there, guys, we're going to go up here. We have two uh, setups we want to use here. First, we have the uh, goblin teams. Again, the orc team, always. That, that, and that. That's that's a solid team here, guys. That's not going to be a 52 points, though. Uh, that's just going to be a uh, pretty decent clear. Please, that is the objective. So first thing we want to do, we want to do a ability block on this one. Well, just the days is fine, to be honest. And we actually got the stun, which was great. We want to prevent this uh, Trump Guard to actually... Um, wow. Do that thing. That taunt. So that's the next uh, objective here. We got the days. We got the ability block. We're going to charge this one up. And try to get a taunt here. We got the taunt. So that is great. Uh, and then um, I guess we should get started to work on the Renara because we don't want her to res anybody. So we're going to start slowly working on that. We have the blind here, so we don't have to worry about anybody, really, other than getting another uh, 
another uh, wow ability block on this dude here we go killing something how uh, it targets the goddamn minions huh yeah it is what it is now this is about to be dead so renara is gonna be dead and now all we're gonna do is kill this one and yeah that's a lot easier than expected these two are dead this one's getting dazed so it's not gonna do a lot of damage actually it's getting dead so yeah now what as well i expected here guys can we finish this up eh, almost almost there we go so obviously it's not 52 points run but that is a lot of points run man 50 points we only lost two shield points that's actually very very solid guys I cannot complain here with the start of this battleground. Now it's getting to Goblin. We said we're going to be bringing the Pride team. Why the Pride? Because we want the days. We want the days. We want to prevent them from doing anything great. And we want to murder them at the same time. So we're going to bring uh, our two uh, main Prides with that. In theory, we should bring an AoE character with that. But we are starting to run low on characters. I mean, we're not doing that bad. We're gonna need the orc next, so yeah, we are probably gonna go with with what? Let's bring a healer just in case we take extra damage here. I mean, we should just bring the DPS. I mean, I mean, we're not gonna get worried about. She's not gonna do great DPS, but she's gonna be enough DPS to do. And we're gonna save her out to be put with somebody that actually needs it more. See here, we got the days. So even if we get annoyed by uh, this dude. Which we're going to try to kill first. And then if we get annoyed by him, we're still going to be fine. Okay, we're not going to use that ability. Because the AoE from Kegi shall actually take this one out. Hopefully. Hopefully I'm not messing up. So we're going to attack the tank here. Here we go. And boom. Okay, that did exactly what it was supposed to do. We removed the shock. No more shock. That is great. We actually put a fake talent here. Oh, we got a real talent now. That's great. Taking some AoE damage, but not much. Not much. Charge up. Let's do that. Kill this one. Nope. Okay, we're not killing this one, apparently, guys. Let's do that here. I mean, we're going to be missing uh, three points so far, which is actually not that bad. It's not as good as we wanted, but it's definitely not that bad. There and there. Oh. We did not finish it. Now we're going to finish it. There we go. So that shall be another 49 points, guys. And it's okay. For a, a pride team, that's actually pretty solid. You can see 5, 5, and 2. So we lost 3 points here. So that's actually a pretty good battleground so far. We only lost 5 points so far in 3 match. Okay, so we got this one done. Let's take a look at what we got in the back here. Oh, that one is going to be... a. Uh, it's going to be easy. I mean, we're going to have to handle that one on the top. But this one? This one, the easy peasy a solo air, guys. You're wondering why I'm sending this guy alone? You're going to see, guys. He's a freaking monster. I always do that. And yeah. He's just going to one shot one people at a time. And not one shot, but counter attack and kill and be pretty much unkillable. That's pretty much the thing here. He's very awesome for that. We're going to have to kill the two humans here. Oh, we're actually going to kill her. Hell yeah. Goodbye, girl. So no more taunt. And in theory here, guys, we should finish with 51 points. That's usually what we do on this fight with uh, Kinley. This is dead. I mean, it can not even go through my shield, so that's kind of simple. Here we go, guys. 51 points very easy now we're gonna leave the other team there because we're gonna see what we have left at the end to actually go against this team we want to see what we have in the back uh bottom right too before we go crazy now here uh we're gonna go orc we're still gonna have some panda yeah we're still gonna have a pretty decent team to be honest at the end okay so here we're gonna go orc guys one, two, three, four, and five. And then we're going to have six characters left. In theory, we shall have a solo talent and then the other five in a team, pretty much. 
That's the objective. So I'm going to go with this one, guys. We could have kept Zelenor out of it, guys, and save him for something uh, where we need more help. But I don't think we're going to need him. So that's why I'm actually bringing him in this team. And that's the last time we actually bring the Zelenor in this team. Because you're going to see, guys, in a couple days, uh, we're going to showcase the new... Uh, champion we have on the roster and we are going to be uh, sending new defense obviously once again guys i know we just did it but we have more defense to do again and you notice guys i finally made my uh garn faster than my zira which means we get to apply buff immunity now we finally did it guys okay we got a talent out there that's great Kind of need to get rid of this dude, though, before he blinds us. And we did not succeed, guys. That's fine. That's fine. Apply some heal, some shield. We still got the talent here. I mean, now we don't have a choice but to use the talent there, too. Just fine. Okay, we're going to kill this guy. Oh, we can't. We're going to kill this guy, then. Here we go. We're going to take care of this guy next. Oh, I almost killed him. Damn. Here we go. More talent. Yeah, oh, that was a nice hit there. Damn. Can we last one more turn here? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Because I wanted to go with another heal. But, hey. It's fine. We still got a decent amount. We lost a lot of points there, though. We lost 5 points. So, so far, if I'm not wrong, we lost 10 points, which is not that bad, but it's not that great. Actually, 6 points we lost so far. So, let's take a look here. Yeah, this is going talent solo. That is the objective. And then after that, I guess we're going to have uh, 4, 4, 4, uh, I would call them. Wow. <laughs> For Pendo and Renara for the last team, which should definitely work pretty good. Okay, so first thing we're going to do. Work on him. There we go. And now we got AoE ready and it's game over. Boom. Oh, we're going to finish our. So it's going to be a 51 points. Uh, obviously, we don't have a full shield because we got attack. So only 51 points here, but that is still very solid battleground here. Okay, now we got the last attack to do, guys. Which should be pretty solid. I mean, the objective is finish with full shield. I don't know if we're going to be able to achieve that because this is still a very solid team. But all right, we're going to try. We're going to try. So that's the team here, guys, with uh, this guy lead, which is going to be very, very useful. If we get to heal, we apply shield based on the amount of heal, too. So, which is great. Hopefully, we're going to get to keep uh, most of the shields. The objective is to finish with 52 points here, but no guarantee that is going to be happening. Because her, she's going to take a little bit of damage. Okay, this is done. Ah, man. Okay, we still kill it, so that's great. Now, that person is getting a shield, obviously. Does that work now? We do zero healing when we do that. I did want to test it, see if that's going to work. And uh, now we got the answer. Okay, want to kill her. We'll almost kill her. Here we go. Then we want to work on this one. Dead. And then, we're, oh, we're going we're gonna to get that 52 points, guys. Holy shit. I did not expect that. That's actually a great team, uh, you know. A very great team. I like this thing. We should make that a real team. That will be interesting for people. At least on offense, it's going to be a real team. So, we actually got second best battleground this season so far. And that's going to put us at 3-0, and guys. And that's going to put us a few, three points behind the personal best of this season. So, definitely a very, very solid battleground, guys. But I want to know, how did your battleground go? And... Uh, did you work on new characters with the Thanksgiving Black Friday events so you can actually, you know, improve your Battleground, uh, you know, performances? Uh, let me know in the comment section, guys. As always, uh, thank you for watching. Thank you for being part of my amazing community. You all keep enjoying playing Dragon Champion. And I will see you guys again in the next video. Thank you.